Hello guys, it is Saturday, January the 28th, and got a real quick video. I have been on Golo now for one week exactly. Um, you know, you can't get on the Golo forms or their Facebook page unless you are a Golo, unless you order it or you have it. But once you're on there, you know, it's funny, they say you can eat what you, eat regular food, I guess is what the, what the commercial says. Yeah, like hardly nothing. Their list of food, they don't, they not only want you to take this pill, they want you to eat certain food off of a list. To me, this food is like eating nothing basically nothing I am very picky there is nothing on that list that I would eat except like four or five things I think it's peas green beans tuna and then of course they list beef and they list all the meats but you can only have so many hold on I gotta in or out these cats are in and out in and out in and out there's only so much they want you to eat you know, if you would, I don't know. I don't do that because I don't, I'm too picky of an eater. I have been watching what I eat. I, I've not ate any more pretzels. I've not had any M&Ms. I've not had any sweets. There have been times I have ate out for a family thing and I still do it, but I do take the pill. I take the pill once, three times a day with your food. Sometimes I don't eat breakfast, so I don't take a pill. But if you would actually, to me, this is my opinion, go by what they say to eat only, just eating that's gonna make you lose weight. What does the pill do? I mean, if you eat what they say on that list and they want you to weigh it, they want you to make stuff how they want you to make it, they want you to make certain recipes. You know, I'm not going to be doing that. But if you would do that, yeah, you would lose weight anyway. So I will say one thing. Now, I don't know if the pills have anything to do with it at all. I have not had a low blood sugar attack this whole week. And I do have trouble with low blood sugar. And I don't know if that has anything to do with the Golo pills or not. But that has happened. Now, this week, I have not been able to walk on the treadmill. Maybe like one night I was able to. Um, I've had too much stuff going on when I get off work. So, God, my mouth is so dry. I need to drink water. Um, but like I said, I have watched what I have ate and not totally restricted myself like they do. But I have done enough myself that I feel okay about it. Um, now today we're going to a, a, a meeting with some relatives and I'm going to Pizza Hut Buffet. You know, I'm going to eat pizza and um, I'll sneak a pill in there. And then tomorrow we're going out for my nephew's birthday to Applebee's and I'm going to eat there too. Now, a lot of times when I eat out for lunch, I don't eat anything for dinner because I'm still full. So, um, but I don't know. If you saw that list of the food that they only want you to have, it is like, it is like basically not eating. Um, so what is Golo doing to make you lose weight? Is it a mind thing? Oh, I take this pill and I know it's working. I know it's going to make me lose weight. I don't know. Uh, does it react with, because they say take it with your food, not before you eat and not after. Take it while you're eating. So does it have something to do with food and the pill and what's in it? I don't know. But very interesting. That Golo Facebook forum People are like, oh, I'm starving all the time, you know, or can I have this substitute for 
for uh, sugar and can I know we don't want you to have sugar can I have Dipoc no we don't want you to have Dipoc can I have this can I have that people are saying that all the time they're like no 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 you have to follow this you have to do this you have to do this and I'm sure there's people that follow it to the letter I mean if you liked all that stuff you know you could probably eat a t uh, you know some you'd eat some of it but I don't like it and there's nothing that's going to make me eat certain things that I do not like, diet or no diet. So I'm just going to watch what I do day by day and uh, go from there. Now, <laughs> I don't get paid until Tuesday and I have a ton of ramen noodles stacked up. So I had to resort to eating my ramen noodles for lunch at work. I'm going to try not to eat them here at home. But um, I really don't have too much here yet, so I might get a little messed up next couple days, especially with this eating out. After this, I probably don't have a reason to eat out till my mom's birthday, middle of February. So, but it's not quite what I thought it was. I mean, I'm going to stick with it. I mean, have I lost weight? I don't weigh myself. But I can tell my genes are better. I can tell I can move around better. I feel better. I have to say that. Um, um, yeah, so I'm, it's slow. I'm trying, of course, without, <coughs> sorry. My, my throat is so dry. Of course, without um, walking this week, that didn't help me any. Um, I can't always fit that in. So, this is week one, just first week. So, hopefully, I'll kind of get revved up and get going and start walking and then see what that does. But so far, I feel better, you know, but is that because I've quit eating the stuff I quit eating? Yeah, I don't know. But if you're really into weighing your food and only doing what they want you to do, then, yeah, but they don't tell you that on the commercials. They don't say, you have to eat from a certain list and don't go over that list. And and um, they try to help each other out, you know, of course, the members of that forum, you know, like, oh, have you tried to cook it like this? Have you tried this? Have you tried that? But the people, the company, when they answer something on Facebook, they're like, uh, strict to the letter. You have to do this. You have to do this. You cannot have this. You cannot have that. Well, yeah, that's going to make you lose weight anyway. So I don't know. I'm just reporting how I think and what I feel. And I am a picky eater and I'm probably not the best person to say, you know, give this a review, but I'm sure I'm not the only picky eater out there. But I am going to enjoy my Pizza Hut today and my Applebee's tomorrow. And, you know, but a big one for me is not snacking because at work I would always grab a handful of pretzels or M&Ms and just eat on them during the day. But I have not been doing that at all. I have not even bought any pretzels. I'm out of M&Ms. And I try to keep some around just in case my blood sugar gets low, but it has not this week. But, and I'm still drinking my Diet Pop. You know, some stuff I am not going to give up. Diet Pop has no sugar and no fat in it. And I'm just going to be doing that. Um, I have not drank water like I'm supposed to or I should do. That's probably why I'm so dried up. It's just dry here where I live. But I'm going to, you know try to drink more water but that's my opinion of my first week so I just wanted to get that in there and um, we'll see what happens next Saturday okay guys I will talk to you later